What up, chat? What up, chat? So the clickbait. <laughs> what up, chat? So the uh, title is not clickbait. We are actually going to Japan. Not soon, but you know, we're going on April 1st. And if it didn't click in your head already that that's April Fool's Day, then you're like me. But regardless, uh, we're, I'm going April 1st for a week. I don't really know what I'm going to do over there, but, you know, just going with the homie. The race, awesome for him. And then I was like, I'm, and then I saw him for him. I'm like, I'm sorry, I forgot. Who's this? This person? Well, he's not fault. He ran the stop sign. He said it's okay. Like, I don't know what you said. Yeah, he's like, I don't know what you said. You remember that, right? Yeah, it was like yeah. a Snapchat event. Pretty funny. I want to tell him I feel sorry for us. Did he slid your DMs later? Huh? No, I didn't. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, my bad. I got it wrong. You just did it again. Well, oh, shit, bro. This wasn't much of a video, to be honest. Probably not even gonna be a video out of this. Maybe an Instagram pose, though. Um. Your chest pump's pretty gnarly right now. I'm liking the way I'm looking these days. With a pump at least. Um, yeah, I got a big week. And got work. Uh, Whitecaps game, soccer game. And then I'm going to play a soccer game at 9 p.m. Yeah, today's Friday, tomorrow's Saturday. Sunday I'm off and I'm about to go cop a massage right now after I do a little bit of cardio so I hope you have a great day and just remember that getting jacked solves all your problems look at these colors That's pretty good, I think, right? Maybe. Yep, I'm going to Japan, but um, I had something else to say. In one of my other videos, I talked about how uh, how like having happiness as a motivation was no bueno. Like people were saying that that it was no bueno. And I think I understand why now. I thought about it. I've been thinking about it since I heard it. Um, and um, my conclusion was is that if you're always chasing happiness, you know, it would be like chasing something that's right in front of you. Because just going throughout life normally you're gonna experience happiness, right? With like whenever you, whenever you want, really, you know, if you want to be happy, go do something you enjoy doing, you know. Um, but I think a lot of people where they fuck it up is a lot of people are like they're looking for that eternal happiness, that long-lasting happiness. You know, I'm gonna buy this car, and then I'm gonna be happy. Or I'm gonna get rich and then I'm gonna be happy forever. But um, I think what they're actually looking for is, stay with me, is God, bro. That feeling inside of you where you're trying to be like happy forever, that's like, that's like God.
Like you'll only be happy forever, I think, when you get to heaven. If if you go to heaven, because people these days are obsessed with material things. I feel like, especially money. Like I was just saying, like homies think they could cop a car and then they're gonna be happy, but but it, it's only temporary. It's only temporary. And so that's what I think the homie meant when he said uh, happiness was a bad motivation. Because you don't want to chase something that's right in front of you, you know. Like you're going to be happy in life. Even if you try your hardest not to be happy, I think you'll still end up being happy sometime. I've also thought a lot about um, how to be happy. Like if someone were to ask me the question, yo, Keith. How do I be happy? You know? And there's everyone. This is the funny thing. Is that every single person on this planet would have a different answer. Why is that? Because there's no right answer. There's not one way to navigate life. So, how do you be happy? The answer that I come up with is just to do shit just do shit just do something doesn't have to be something productive look at me i'm sitting in front of this camera with this silly light and the silly little microphone at 5 28 p.m on a monday i could be grinding you know a second job trying to get more money i could be you know watching netflix i could be outside i could be at the gym Although uh, I'm resting today. But you know what I mean? There's so many different things that you could do. And there's not one right thing. I was laying in bed like half an hour ago. I came home from work really early. I only worked for a couple of hours today. That's just how work went. And I come home and I was just eating my lunch. Uh, watching Netflix. And then uh, my boss called and said, Yo, Keith, can you go do a paint run? I had to go pick up paint. In, uh, in a city, you know, a couple cities over, not that far, maybe 25 minute drive, 25 minute drive back. And uh, so I went and did it, smoked a J on the way, and then came home and just fucking lay laid in bed. And uh, I probably laid in bed for like half an hour and then I just threw my phone to the side and then just closed my eyes and just lay there again. And, uh, you know, I could have done that the whole rest of the day. And I would have felt like shit at the end of the day because I didn't fucking do anything. And uh, I would have up, woken up tomorrow feeling like shit probably too. And I would have had to, I had to, you know, crawl through that shit to uh, have a good day, you know. But now I'm... I'm uh, talking to the camera so I can hopefully edit it soon and put put a video out and then you know that'll make me feel more accomplished by the end of the day and uh, yeah that's what I do to feel happy you know if I were to lay in bed all day I'd feel like shit I would anyone would um, so I do shit not a bunch of shit, but I just, you know, do something.